Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today's weekly customs. And I can guarantee you this. It's not another AJ Styles. I promise. Okay, I wanted to do one, but uh, never say never for next week. So my streak pretty much ended. So this week's weekly customs is none other than AJ Styles. No, 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 no. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Please don't click off. Please don't click off. I need the views. I need the views. So this is not the custom. So I already showed this. So, so AJ Styles, go away. Oh shit, I just broke something. But that but it's not AJ Styles, I promise you. It's another wrestler from TNA, but it's not AJ Styles or Samoa Joe or Abyss. He is in WWE right now, I think. So I might as well get this one out of the way. This one is long overdue and it really deserves it and I do got to fix it up a little bit. So uh, I'm going to have to put a new name for him in the in the title of this video so that way it doesn't offend anybody. But this is this week's custom. You have no idea who this guy is. This is a custom elite suicide. And if you don't know who suicide is, he was from... He was originally from the TNA video game. He was a fictional character from there. And this was him. And what you had to do, or what happened, was you got beat down by LAX in Mexico. Then they dropped your body off and... Uh, somewhere in Mexico, then doctors find you, and then you got, like, bandages and shit all over your face. And then you get a new identity. And then you gotta wrestle from, like, Mexico to the armory to TNA. Then you get signed there, then you team with Eric Young to become the TNA Tag Team Champions, and he gets hurt then. You gotta fight um, Kurt Angle for the TNA World Heavyweight Championship. You win, and then... You're supposed to drop the title to Jeff Jarrett the, ne the next night, but then you, you don't, so. Yeah, I do love this suicide. And the funny thing was, was when that game released, he actually came to life. Thus, thus the theme song of his, uh, thus, thus his theme song, Suicide Comes Alive. So I've seen a lot of people do this, and I've noticed there aren't a lot of suicide customs out there, because if you had the deluxe edition, I don't know if you could morph that with this. But either way, this is a kick-ass suicide. So what I did is I used a Rey Mysterio head scan. It still has the sort of molding right there and back here. And this decal, actually, I put one on here and it was messed up. And I put another one on here. And it me looks messed up a little bit. I don't know how well it's going to come out on camera. If it will even come out on camera. That good? Come on, you're almost there. There you go. So what I did here is actually... The mask sort of bent right here, and that's why it has a little bit of wrinkles in there. But if you notice when superstars are wrestling, their mask can get wrinkly over time, so I guess it works. So, and the body is WrestleMania 30, um, yeah, WrestleMania 30 Daniel Bryan. Painted random arms, I can't tell you what arms these are, probably Daniel Bryan's, and then... Um, random, ra random knee pads, I p or el uh, elbow pads I painted red. The legs are the first Elite Neville with Finn Balor knee pads I painted. And then, of course, I painted this with the Suicide logos on here. And here's the thing. This is the Suicide decal right here. Um, I'm not sure seeing if I can find the logo in my drawer. But actually, that's, that Suicide logo right there is actually two different logos, actually. So, I'm going to try seeing if I can find the logo. So, I'll be right back. Okay, so I found the logos, and this is actually one that he wore in TNA. I just printed that off as a reference. And this is actually what I got. So imagine this logo right here with this font, sort of. It did not have this block font. It just had this normal font that said Suicide. So I, I found one online that had this block lettering, and it just did the logo here did not look right with this. So what I did is this is actually two different logos. I cut off... The logo, that logo, the, the bottom one that was on here, I cut it, put it on there, and then I cut out the black lettering that was right here, and I pasted it over, and it looks amazing. I also got this extra suicide logo if it didn't work, and I got the Los Cinco Renables and Kenny Omega for different customs. But either way, I do love it. I do love how the suicide looks. I actually did not point this out, but I actually put another logo on the back. So let me know what you guys think about this custom in the comments, because it's honestly a pretty good custom. If you guys are thinking about making it, um, please do, because it's it's pretty good when 
when it's all said and done, and this is not going anywhere, so, so, Cloud Kid, don't ask in the comments to have this, because you're not going to get it. So, either way, that's this week's Weekly Customs. Thanks for watching. It's not another AJ style, so don't write it in the comments. The, the first 18 seconds was just clickbait. Hopefully, that's not the thumbnail. But, but either way, thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm actually going to Cloud Kid's house. I'm not sure if there's going to be a vlog, but whatever. So, I'll see you guys in the, in the next Weekly Customs, or whenever I post another video. Thanks for watching.